we caught some Mayan cichlids and some tilapia. Mostly Mayans, I think. A few bluegill in our pond. In our ponds. So we're gonna give them to these killers. Let's see how they like it. is milling around no not impressed new guy I guess you're not too hungry then. You guys hesitating, wow. He's already got appetite. I brought him I brought him two days ago. From Mark. The new, new red tail showing some interest in the in the Mayan cichlid. He's been eating live vieja cichlids in his pond, so I'm surprised to see that he's showing interest in the dead food so quickly. Two days ago he made the transfer from his pond, spent an hour, over, uh, over an hour in formal in Malachite green bath, then 15-20 minutes in uh, potassium permanganate bath, probably 15, 10 to 15 rather. Looks like nobody wants the Mayan for now. Oftentimes, I mean, I don't know. Right now is because it's a colder time of the year. Only some fish are starting to get prepared for the next breeding season, like arowana. But in this tank, it seems nobody. Nobody cares that the spring is coming and they need to bulk up. The big red tail is smelling it. Maybe he'll take it. He's just coming off of the long, long fast. No. Nope. Due to vitamin B1 deficiency. Parun shied away, didn't take it, the big one. Looked at it and turned away. Fish don't like change. They want everything to be the same, including their feed. It smells the same. Tastes the same. Looks the same.
small balloon is eyeing it up. Shows no desire to take it. They were killing a tilapia for two days, which was ten times bigger than that Mayan, and live, it was running away from them. That they were happy to do. You give them a dead food, they don't want to take it. kill a foot, two foot tilapia that we cannot swallow. If you give us this, we're not going to take it. That's wonderful. <laughs>